guys, welcome back to my channel. On today's video, we're going to be planning for February 10th through the 16th, which is Valentine's Day week. I will be using my Valentine's Day kit that I got from Planner Kate this week. And this is one of those kits that was duplicated. So I have another, I can use this another week in February if I want, or I can save it for something else like um, our anniversary or whatever with hearts. I don't know. I haven't decided yet, but I'm going to be using that. I have some washi strip and of course the strip cutter to go with it. I'm put this one back really quick. And I use, if you haven't seen my other videos, I use the Erin Condren Life Planner in the Hourly Neutral. I'm just a hourly type of person. It is what works best for me. So I've tried the vertical and horizontal, and honestly, I, I didn't give them too much effort because I knew, like, within the first week that it just was not going to work out for me. So I'm pulling out all of my planner stuff that I use which um, my regular stuff is my ruler, whiteout. I use this 0.5 friction pilot, which is er erasable. I really love that. And then I use this fine point Sharpie and my little cutter that I use for my washi and of course my mild liners. So let's just dig in, shall we? the quick little layout I'm loving it and we're going to before I forget so this week I'm going to try something different I think I'm going to lay the stickers out before I write on them and that way I can kind of like get a good visual of before the pen so that's what I'm going to do first we're going to go to my February week yeah, this week is super busy. Okay. So, I have dinner with friends Monday at 5.30. So, we're going to do, let's see. I think I'll do just a basic. Well, no, I'm going to use these for the kids. Basketball. No, no, I'm going to use this. Okay, what did I say? 5.30, so we'll do, no. I'm gonna do a block. Sorry, I'm like so hectic. We'll go like this and cover it like that. Although I think it's gonna be much, I guess I'll use my washi. It's gonna be longer than that, but we'll go like this. Hmm, think. Because Jackson, of course, has basketball, and so does Kaylee, so that's going to be like a ton of stickers here. So, shoot, I wanted to just do one cute sticker. Let's think. Put this one back. We're going to do, so Kaylee's got basketball at four. And I always try to get this centered. So Kaylee's got basketball at four. Jackson's got basketball at seven. We'll use this black flag one. Okay. 
Okay. And then I have dinner right here. So we will use need something of a different color. We'll just use this. And you know what? I'll go like this. There we go. He might just have to miss basketball, but we'll see. Because we've been having a ton of people pick him up and take him to basketball since I've been gone for the last few weeks. And I just, I know my husband hates having to like ask and rely on people to help us out, even though it's no big deal. Everyone, it's a small town and everyone, like we all, he grew up with pretty much everyone that our kids are now growing up with. My husband grew up with their parents. So, which is just kind of another reason I love living in this little small town we do because it's just fun not for me necessarily because I don't I don't know the people as well but like it's nice that my husband has that relationship already like they were friends in high school elementary school through high school and now we they, we all have kids that are now in sports together so that's always kind of fun okay so that'll do for there what else did I have so PTO I'm going to try to start going to PTO that's at 6 p.m. And I'll put that there. And then my niece's birthday is the 13th. And I'm going to just, let's see, I'll put this at this spot to remember. And I'm going to do the little balloons. Okay. And Valentine's Day, of course. Let's think. I wonder if I have anything cute. Probably not in my sticker book, but I might have some cute stuff in all of these books for Valentine's Day. Um, let's see. Yeah, we'll use this. So... I'll probably do these little hearts and I'm just gonna kind of put it there and I'm gonna use this one down here and I'll probably do this. mark off our date night. Okay, I'm going to cut this down. So we went and saw a couple weeks ago we went and saw Bad Boys 3, and that was so good if anyone loves those movies. The third one was really cute. Um, so I don't know. And then they have the photograph. I keep seeing previews for that movie. It's called The Photograph, I believe, or The Photographer. I can't remember. But like, there's really no good movies coming out. It's a bummer, but it doesn't mean we're not going to go see a movie. We'll definitely go see something but it's just like it's almost better though when you're super excited for a movie there's a couple really good movies coming out but it's not till spring um but yeah so my bro his birthday is the 15th so i'm gonna just do another little reminder here since it's a saturday um i wonder if i have an old kit where i could use A birthday thing. I'm not going to use purple. Nope, nope, nope. Balloons. That's navy blue. I don't really want to mess with that. Orange, of course. 
then to that. Oh, well, I'm sure I have some on here. Here's a pink one. We'll use that. Okay. So, do this for my brother's birthday. That's cute. And what else? Basketball. Kiddos have basketball. At, oh, Ugh, Ann Jackson has baseball at 10.30. Okay, we're going so, Jack's got baseball at 10.30. We're going to do this. Now I'm going to use a big box because that will take, these are like his evaluations for, it's, it, they call them evaluations. It is, it's tryouts. Um, whether they want you to believe that or not, because, you know, he's in fourth grade, so they try not to say it's tryouts, but it's totally, it's tryouts. So he's got baseball there, and then he ha the kiddos have basketball. So let me get out my basketball stickers. I am so tired. Traveling is no stinking joke. It's, you know, about three hours to get there. So just driving in the car alone for three hours is exhausting. Not that three hours is like this huge deal, but um, going through the, like, it's not a relaxing drive when you're driving through snow. So it's just long and stressful and I'm always tense when I'm done. So 12.30 and 3.30. That's perfect. So we're going to go like this. 12.30 and 3.30 for games. I don't want that to overlap that, so we'll go like this. I can never get these straight because half of it's cursive-y and then the other half, cursive-y is definitely a word, by the way. Okay, there's that. Grace's birthday, Ryan's birthday, Valentine's Day, basketball. Oh my gosh, you guys. <sighs> I'm tired. I need a nap. This is Sunday. <laughs> Not Saturday, so I need to move these over. So basically, Saturday is going to be crazy. And then Sunday is going to be kind of crazy because I need to... We need to go to Costco at some point this weekend. My husband and I are both starting our like eating and nutrition or, like workout schedule, so he's doing something different than I am. But we're both starting Monday, trying to meal meal plan and prep and stuff. So I need to do all of that on Sunday. Okay, so Thursday is the day that I think I have to go to Redmond again, Central Oregon. So I'm gonna mark that. Right here. And I think it's just going to be for the day. And I'll probably stay the night. Shoot. I don't know. I might leave like Wednesday. And then be there. Or I don't know. We'll see. It depends on the pass. But in fact, I don't even think I'm going to mark it. Because I just don't know what days yet. So I'm going to take that off. And then I can always use that thin washi that I got if I need to. Okay. So we'll save this guy. And I'm going to mark church right here. And now what I'm going to do is... I need to mark off the date. Like, I need to grocery shop. And I wish I had checklists. I wonder if I have any checklists here I can use that match. I'll use that pink one, probably. OK, 
Okay, that's the only ones that I see. So we're gonna do my to-do list like right here. And oh, I need some black right here. So to-do. Okay, actually, I think I want this all on that side. There we go. I like that better. Okay. And when, so, okay, I mean, I might as well finish doing the kids' sports stuff. So, we're doing these for Kaylee. She scored three baskets last week and, like, had, like, three steals right in a row. I guess, I guess she played super good. My husband was, like, stoked. Um, I think she's going to be our little baller. Jackson, and then Jackson has practice on Fridays. Oh, I, I bet you he won't because it's Valentine's Day. And he's not going regardless, so I'm not even going to mark that. Okay, so... I think we can start filling stuff in, but I want to kind of line this up, get a good view. Super pretty, simple, I like it. Okay, we're going to do my sidebar really quick. Kind of forgot about that. So let's see. I've been liking doing these little flag guys. And I kind of want to keep the sidebar this neutral color, like that. Oh, I need to mark my to-do list for the week, and I also need to mark my videos next. Okay, I think I'm just going to do my videos down here with my YouTube stickers. And we will do black. So I do Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday are my upload days. And my sidebar is going to be pretty simple, but I need to do... Um, This week, and let's, I might go like I actually want to do my to do that I put over here. This is going to be a to go because Sunday after church we need to go. Costco and go grocery, pick up our groceries. Probably we're just going to pick them up instead of having them delivered this week since we'll be out and about. Okay. And I need to do film Saturday's video during nap, probably. So I'm going to say. Well, now I like to upload it then. Shoot, guys, I always struggle with this, but I want to have it uploaded Saturdays for you. So, I think I might switch it. We'll upload it Sunday because that's the day most people plan. I think that's what I originally started doing, but I had to move it for some reason. So, we'll just do it like this. And... I don't think I'll get it done between that, but I'll probably have to do it Saturday night. So we'll just do it down there. 
Okay. And uh, let's see. What else do I need to remember to do? I get paid on Monday, so I need to remember to do pay bills. So I'll put this up here. Okay. Now we're going to start filling stuff in. trying to make it so I can actually check things off which is why I'm doing that because I feel like I'm more productive when I can actually cross it off um I'm gonna do garbage day up here and I'll just do it right there and I'll probably order my groceries Saturday night so we'll go like this. So I remember to do that. And I just need to also do the obvious, which is clean. And I've been gone, so I just need to clean the whole house because my husband picks up. But with being alone with for weeks, basically, with four kids, I don't expect him to, like, get down and dirty and clean the toilets. So I need to do that. Fun for me. Okay, guys. This wraps up my plan with me. It looks good. Um, it's going to be a super busy week. Of course, these hours fill in with all of my stinking work schedule, which is crazy. There's a couple ongoing meetings that, like... I can write in that are every single day. Um, we have a daily ops call. At 8.30. And Monday, what's Monday? So I have to run billing. So I'm gonna do that. I try to do that around 12 and I run the billing for the whole company. And 
and that usually takes a good couple hours. And then Tuesday we have our billing meeting. I'm gonna do this right here. And we have warps. Oh my gosh, I think this week is BRC too. Ugh. I think it might be the 17th. I think so. 1 p.m. We have all of our yearly audits coming up that we do at our facility. Um, we work with food, so there's a ton of food safety audits and organic audits and all of these things, and that's coming up. Um, And Wednesday, I need to confirm billing. I'll do this one for that. And I try to do that around one. Okay. And I'm sure, like I said, there'll be much more to fill in for work later, but um, it all depends on when and if I need to go back to Central Oregon. Um, but yeah, I'm going to do that cute little heart there. Okay, that's it. Um, thanks for stopping by. If you have not already, please subscribe to my channel. And don't forget to hit the notification bell so you are notified every time I release a video. Like I said, I try to do it three times a week. Um, lately it's been twice because I've been gone so much, but hopefully life will slow down or I will just be better at scheduling my videos ahead of time. So thanks for stopping by. I will see you guys next time. Bye.